guys welcome back to another new video and in today's video we are going to learn how to do a brute force attack now in this tutorial i will be showing you how to do a brute force attack and crack the password of anyone's instagram account now first of all disclaimer this video is only meant for educational purposes not use this for unethical purposes i won't be responsible for the misdeeds you do take this video only for knowledge purpose and through this video learn how you can make yourself secure from such attacks don't use this and hack someone else's instagram uh, without their permission so uh, in this tutorial we'll be learning about brute force attacking so without any further delay let's go now before learning about brute force attacking what you need to know is what is a brute force attack basically in a brute force attack uh, trial and error method is used here there is a word list which contains lots of password and each password is being matched once the password matches correctly then the terminal will show you the what the real password of the account is so basically this is an, a, a trial and error method kind of a thing it's useful when the password is very common and it, it might be a little time consuming but it's a very simple attack to do and using this you can easily uh, crack passwords and all and this is very much used in these cyber security fields so without more explanation let's jump into the tutorial so here i am on my kali linux machine now i prefer kali linux you can also use other linux like ubuntu linux or parrot linux whatever you like but here i am using kali linux so first of all what i will do is i will open up the terminal window here now if you want to know more about Kali Linux about its basics then I have already made tutorials on it on my YouTube channel you can go and see them so it will help you to know the basics of this uh, Kali Linux operating system first of all here what we will do is we will install Tor now Tor is the onion router which basically hides you in the web basically what Tor does is it creates multiple layer of IP addresses uh, just like there are multiple layers in an onion it creates multiple layers of IPs and thus it hides you in the web so we will not go into too much detail for Tor but we will just simply install it now to install it we need to use sudo apt get install Tor now here I will give you all the codes which are being used here in my description so that it becomes easier for you to learn so let's write sudo apt get installed tor now sudo it is given so that you can give root permission so that it can install tor and apt get install tor through this we can install the tor in our system let's press enter now provide the password yes and it is done so basically the tor thing it is downloaded uh, inside your machine now what we will do is we will do git clone and this uh, i'll provide this link in the description box so basically here we are going to the github we are downloading resources from github rather so let's press enter and this brute insta thing it is downloaded now let me show you first this is what we have just downloaded into our system this is brute insta now here you will get this path password.lst now this is a word list which contains see lots of passwords over there so basically what it will do it will it will match these passwords and then uh, if the part password matches correctly then uh, the password will be cracked and you will gain access to the Instagram account now there are many such word lists one of the most popular word lists is rocku.txt now I've already made a separate video on rocku.txt if you want to view it then it's on my channel you can go and uh, view it so now I will open another terminal window and I will start Tor 
now basically what this store does is as i told earlier that it will create multiple layer of ip so that you can be hidden uh, from the internet your real ip address your real proxies won't be known to outsiders so you can see that the tor circuit has been established now we'll come back here and we'll go to cd uh, brute insta ch to mod now before that let me show you there are these files insta.sh password.lst and readme.md whatever now what we will do is we will use this code and then we will use this code to run the file and here you go your brute force attack has been already established now before that we need to run this as a root it is saying that please run this program as root basically if you don't give root permission or administrator permission it won't run so we'll write sudo and use the same thing now you you need to give the username of the account so that is how you establish a brute force attack now i'm not going to do any attack and i'm not going to show you uh, attack by attacking anyone's instagram i won't even do it for myself and you should not do it for yourself too but through this video what i am trying to convey is that you must always keep your passwords hard keep your password as much hard as possible and as much uncommon as possible and also don't forget to enable two factor authentication like let me show you here you have on your instagram here inside the pa password and security you can enable two factor authentication so that your instagram uh, remains unaffected so that the otp comes first in your mobile and also make sure you have your email id and uh, phone number with your uh, connected with your instagram so that whatever happens an otp or a message comes into your mobile phone first also there is another technique of hacking which is called phishing attack now i'm going to be covering phishing attack in this video but if you want it i will uh, make one video on how to do a phishing attack by creating a phishing website but if you want that video comment down below thanks for watching be safe make sure you follow all necessary safety processes so that uh, your instagram or any other thing doesn't get hacked so also use strong passwords so this is for today's video i hope you like it if you did like this video also do subscribe this channel and share this video as much as possible thanks for watching